Okay, self-defense number five. Okay, this is off of Bunkai from Pinyon 4. All right, very, very similar to self-defense number three when we started out this way. On self-defense number five, we're going to start out very similar, except our hands are going to be open. Okay, once again, we're blocking a punch and striking almost simultaneously. So using Marissa as my partner, I'm going to start off in the ready position. She's going to throw a hook punch with her right hand. I'm going to block it with my left hand and strike with my palm to whatever's there. All right. Now, ideally, lots of times in pre-arrangement, we got to hit them right. Hit. In the reality, when somebody's throwing a punch and their head's all over the place, you're not necessarily going to be very specific where you hit. I'm trying to hit her in the eyebrow, the eye socket right there, but if I get her in the nose or hit her in the cheekbone or catch the top of the forehead or in the chin, it all works. It's all going to snap her head back. So I'm going to come in, block with open hand, strike with an open hand. I'm going to bring her head back down. I'm going to curl her head, my hand behind her head, twist in, and then throw a roundhouse elbow to the jawline, okay, just below the ear, okay, or, some, or the temple, whatever happens to be available. So it's a quick block, strike, and then twist in with the elbow keeping the hand in tight as you twist your body with the elbow. So again, facing towards the camera, practicing it without a partner, you're in your position, you slide into a back stance, but you move forward and drop your weight, okay, for the power and balance. So you're coming in, doing the strike, throwing the palm, make sure your fingers are out of the way, you're not coming in this way, all right? Curl behind the head, pull it in, and then twist tight, into your hand. If you're doing it without a partner, okay, you'd hit your hand into your palm. All right, I'm going to try it out. Haley and Marissa do working with each other. Uh, Haley, I'm going to have you throw the hook punch. Hook punch, block strike, come in, and twist. Okay, and very similar to uh, number two when you're doing short techniques. It's how you're moving your body, turning your hips, transferring the weight from low to high because these techniques by themselves you don't generate a lot of power because you're not really extending them but by putting your body behind it moving in on the strike and really twisting my hips and my shoulders into the elbow okay and hitting with a hard surface that's where the power and effectiveness comes from okay we'll try one more time this time with uh marissa attacking And yummy. Yeah, good. And when you're working with your partner, again, being, in this case, black belts, try to come reasonably close without actually hitting your partner. Okay? When you practice, you want to practice a foot away. You want to come in reasonably close, a couple inches away from your partner. Just be careful. Okay.